Hello aspirants, welcome back to the YouTube channel of Geology Concepts where we provide you valuable insights and strategies for cracking the UPSC Combined Geoscientist examination. In today's video, we will focus on an important aspect of the exam that is covering current affairs effectively. Current affairs play a crucial role in the examination as you know. So let's dive right in and explore some practical strategies that will help you excel in this examination. Before we begin, Let's understand why current affairs are significant for the UPSC Combined Geoscientist Examination. First and foremost, this exam uh, aims to test not only your knowledge of geoscience, but also but your ability to uh, apply that knowledge in the context of current events and environmental challenges. By staying updated with current affairs, you will develop a well-round perspective and be better equipped to answer questions in the actual exam. Right. Secondly, Geoscience is an interdisciplinary field that incorporates various subjects such as geology, hydrology, meteorology and oceanography. Current affairs often involve a blend of these subjects, which will help you see the interconnectedness between different areas of geoscience and understand their practical implications. Third aspect is the exam relevancy of current affairs. So, in all UPSC exams, including the combined geoscientist exam, often questions are based on recent developments, government policies and scientific advancements. By being well uh, versed with in the current affairs, you enhance your ability to answer questions accurately and with a contemporary perspective. Also, current affairs require you to analyze complex situations, evaluate multiple perspectives and form an informed opinion. These skills are vital for aspiring geoscientists like you who must assess and interpret data, make sound judgments and propose effective solutions in their professional careers. Lastly, it is also significant in your, in your interview stage as well. Current affair knowledge is crucial for this stage as it demonstrates your awareness, analytical thinking and ability to express your opinion on relevant issues very confidently. Right? So that is all how significant current affairs is. If that is clear to you, let's explore some of the strategies to cover current affairs effectively. The first strategy is to read newspaper regularly. Now, why is it so important for the geology aspirants like you? Because newspapers are rich source of information which cover a wide range of topics that are relevant to the combined geoscientist exam in both prelims, mains and as well as in interview stages as we already discussed. But in, uh, instead of passively reading these newspapers, you should adopt an active learning approach. So let's see how you can do that. So first thing is by you should start by choosing a reputable newspaper that covers national as well as international news comprehensively. Some popular choices include the Hindu, the Indian Express, etc. As you read, focus on key areas such as science and technology, environment, geography and current events related to geosciences. Also, apart from this, you should focus on relevant sections from your prelim syllabus such as economics, events of national and inter international importance and so on. Next step is to uh, uh, make, a, make it a habit to underline, and underline or highlight important points while you read. So you can jot down relevant information, key statistics and new terminologies that you come across. These notes will help you um, and uh, revise more effectively and will prove invaluable during your last phase of the revision. Now, let's move on to our second strategy which is to leverage technology and digital resources. In today's digital age, there are numerous online platforms that provide quick and accessible current affair updates. So here are a few ways you can leverage technology to stay up to date. Firstly, you, you can download reliable news apps on your smartphones. Apps like InShorts, The Hindu or The Times of India. Uh, they, all, they all provide concise news summaries making it easier for you to cover more grounds in lesser time. Right? Or the second uh, approach is to sub subscribe to reputable uh, YouTube channels and podcasts that focus on current affairs and geoscience related topics. These platforms often offer engaging discussions, interviews and expert opinions that can deepen your understanding of various issues. You can refer to the current Connect series of geologic concepts which cover a wide range of topics from current affairs relevant for the demand of combined geoscientist examination. Right? So these simple yet effective strategies can help reduce your valuable efforts and time that you would have otherwise spent on covering wide range of topics and current affairs from multiple resources. Right? Now that we have covered newspaper and digital resources, let's explore our second strategy, the third strategy, I'm sorry, making current affairs a part of your daily routine. So incorporating current affairs into your daily routine is essential to stay consistently updated. So now let's discuss a few practical tips to make this happen. 
first and foremost allocate a specific time slot in your daily daily schedule for reading newspaper or going through these digital news updates treat it as treat it as a non negotiable appointment with yourself this will help you develop a discipline and make current affairs a regular part of your life it will also restrict and prevent you from unnecessary stress to cover on the current affairs from uh, varied sources right additionally consider joining online study groups or forums where aspirants discuss current affairs engaging in such groups will not only enhance your understanding but also provide different perspectives on the various topics in our courses related to upsc combined geoscientist examination you will be able to do that very effectively lastly practice the art of note making now why do i use the word art because the note making is a game of skill and as you know almost all skills including this one can be developed with practice so while reading or watching news focus on summarizing key points concisely this exercise will not only help in revision but also improve your ability to extract relevant information quickly also remember that patience is a key ingredient in this whole process right so moving on to our fourth strategy let's explore the power of visu visual aids and mind maps visual aids and mind maps are incredibly effective in organizing information and making it easier to recall let's see how we can use them to cover current affairs so you should start by creating mind maps that connect geosciences geoscience concepts with current events for example if you come across an article on climate change create a mind map that links the causes impacts and potential solutions related to geosciences from the newspaper or the online resources you are referring while doing that use color coding symbols and diagrams to make your mind maps visually appealing and memorable these visual aids will help you retain information in a better and quick bit better way and you can quickly revise complex topics during the exam preparation right so for your uh, reference here is how a mind map should be created this particular topic is on climate change and sea level rise the mind, mind map is created in a way that is relevant for both prelims and main stage of the examination findings of ipcc 6 sixth assessment report has been included from the current affairs itself so this is a broad overview of how you should read analyze and make notes in the form of mind maps using information from current affairs lastly let's discuss our fifth strategy which is regular revision and practice no strategy is complete without regular revision and practice right so here is how you can integrate it into your current affairs preparation allocate dedicated time for revision preferably weekly or fortnightly in this case the triple one strategy or i plus 3 strategy will be very effective which says once a topic is finished it should be revised instantly that is the i then after a day then after a week and finally after a month this may help you retain the concept for a long period of time since the process of this exam is itself a long one this revision strategy will be beneficial for you next review your notes mind maps and any important articles you have saved and then reinforce your understanding by discussing these topics with fellow aspirants or mentors to help you doing that a team of dedicated mentors at geology concepts always help you in finding your weak areas and strengthening your conceptual clarity which is very crucial for this examination now in addition to revision you need to solve previous year questions uh, question paper as well and take mock tests that include current affairs questions this practice will familiarize you with the examination pattern and help you identify areas where you need to improve right so you can refer to our dedicated test series for combined geoscientist prelims examination which will help you in this process and that brings us uh, to the end of this video we have discussed five practical strategies to cover current affairs effectively for upsc combined geoscientist examination remember to read newspaper actively leverage technology and digital resources make current affairs a part of your daily routine use visual aids and mind maps and regularly revise and practice and by following these uh, strategies you will stay well informed build a strong foundation and increase your chances of success in this examination if you found this video helpful don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more valuable tips and strategies also feel free to share your thoughts and any additional strategies you use in the comment section below thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video good luck with your preparation and